Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Taurus? Welcome to my late night energy reading. How is everyone doing? Everyone's okay to all of my subscribers. How are you doing? My new subscribers, how are you doing? Thank you so much. Yeah, I haven't done a late night energy reading in a minute. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm really feeling good. I'm really feeling better. Taurus, I thank you so much, everyone. Uh, let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on uh, with you, Taurus, okay? Um, I hope everybody enjoyed their reading today. And I'm going to see what the energy is for you on this late night. Let's see what's going on, who's trying to come through, what's trying to come through, what's trying to pull. Um, I don't do all the extra cards on late night energy. Um, I pretty much try to figure out, um, I try to intuitively um, see um, where your energy is at. Taurus, so let's see. Spirit, Holy Spirit, white light come into this reading. I ask you to give me clarity and understanding. I ask you to give me protection, Spirit, Holy Spirit. All right. So I see that um, a lot of you or someone is over obsessively thinking uh, you're worn out. You're worn out, you're tired about something, okay? Um, you're very tired. Uh, let's see. Spirit, tell me more about Taurus reading. Tell me more. Tell me more about Taurus reading, Spirit. Thank you. I, I see that, um, yeah, someone's very stressed out, very stressed out, uh, worn out, um, and it's, it's like you can't see your way out of something. Um, this is your energy or this is your person's energy, Taurus. I, I get a lot of energy of being stressed. Wow. Yeah. Someone's overindulging, drinking, doing a little bit too much. Uh, someone is possibly doing drugs, something that is very unhealthy. Um, I really pick up on drinking, a lot of entertainment. Um, this person is going to send you a message. Okay. Um, but I don't see you taking a leap of faith with this person, okay? Um, this person is very negative, a very negative person. Um, uh, you could be dealing with uh, fire signs, Sagittarius, um, Aries, Leo, okay? Um, yeah, I get, I get that heavy in here. Um, I really feel like you're looking for something that's dependable, something long term in your life. And this person, um, I feel like this person really stressed you out a lot. I mean, literally wore you out with their drinking um, or this can be them stressed out drinking, uh, ready to send you a message. Um, they, they, he or she is really doing too much. Uh, a lot of recreational uh, things that they're doing that is very unhealthy, Taurus. Unhealthy. Um, and that enough right there by itself, the overindulgent, is enough by itself to... Yeah, to not want you to deal with someone. I, I really feel like this person really wants to 
you know, get back with you. This could, you could have been dealing with someone that was younger, okay, younger than you, or some of you, this person could have been older than you. Whichever way it goes, they were very stuck in their traditional ways about doing things. <clears throat> It was almost like they were very, their ego, they wasn't going to compromise with you. This person um, just was not, does not see anybody but themselves, okay? Very egotistic person. Um, this person was also a negative, you know, they hung around negative energy people. Even though this person is very very intellectual but they're you know they were very easily to influence the people around them could easily influence them to doing things okay um and that right there was like i believe it was the breaking point for you taurus okay let's put that down there so you can see that taurus okay so um, their energy is coming in the reading. He or she, uh, they're worn out thinking about you. They're stressed out thinking about you. They're literally drinking, doing, you know, literally drinking drugs or whatever they're doing. It's very unhealthy. Um, and they're going to reach out to you. They want to send, they're going to send you a message. You know how you get that message from somebody and they've been drinking and they're talking. Yeah, and they say, you know, when somebody speaks from a drunk place, they're speaking the truth. Okay. But I feel as though the Taurus don't, don't care. Taurus don't care uh, or anything because you are not, you don't want to, you don't want to take no type of, a leap of faith with with them at all with her with him at all and so um because of their egotistic ways because of how they let people influence them you know to make decisions to make wrong decisions rather that's friends that's always wanting to party and drink or rather that is um you know, having you in these tied up, you know, triangle relationships or whatever it may be. Um, this person, you just could not deal with it anymore. And like I say, this could be your energy where they stressed you out. OK, as well. But this is their energy coming through. Um, they are just. Um, they are they don't know. They are, it's like they don't, they, they don't know what to feel. Uh, they don't, this person here, she don't know how to make it right. So they just stress themselves out. Okay. Um, I really feel like a lot of you are very happy in your life right, right now. You're free from this person. You don't have to worry about putting up with the, the way, the, you know, how they be drinking and talking junk and wanting to fight and wanting to argue. Uh, yeah, you have gained a lot of control back in your life. You see that? You've gained a lot of control back in your life. And um, you said, mm -mm, no, thank you. Yeah, they're overwhelmed. They having bad, this person's having real bad anxiety. Um, I mean, you know, this type of thing can lead to, lead to, yep, here it is. It can lead to a heart attack they so stressed out. It's your person wants to come back for a second chance, Doris. There it is right there. Yeah, he or she is very, 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 um, overwhelmed, stressed out, drinking a lot, um, and this person wants to come back, wants to save the marriage, okay, he or she wants to come back and save this relationship that y'all were involved with, this is their energy coming through the reading Taurus, um, yeah, overwhelmed. A lot of, excuse me, a lot of, of that energy in here tonight. And all of y'all, you know, you, you, you have your own free will. 
but I really feel like a lot of you, that was an old journey for you, and you starting a new journey. Um, you are definitely holding yourself back from this person. You saying, Miss, Miss Positive Thoughts and Energy, I don't want this person back. I don't have no desire for this person. I'm starting a new journey in my life. That's an old journey. Why are they coming through the reading? And like I have explained before, Taurus, that's just how that works. If they can pull you, if they can pull your energy from somewhere, this person or any energy will do that, okay? We just went through a retrograde where the past always come back up, okay? Things always resurface because people is thinking now more than ever. Just, just take the retrograde out of the equation and just think of what we're going through right now. Uh, people have a lot of time to think, a lot of people have a lot of time to think about the mistakes and think about things that they have done to wrong people in their life. And, um, you you know, we you have no choice but to, to think about things that you have been through in your life. And some people are going to fix it. Some people want to fix it. Some things can't be fixed. Some things are not going to be fixed. But it's just for them to see um, this may not even have anything to do with you, Taurus. This is probably just for them to see that, you know, the universe and the, the divine is letting them see themselves. Okay. And some people can't handle being alone. Okay. So when they can't handle being alone, when they're not used to, you know, plugging into other people, that's when the overindulging come. That's when they try, you know, people try to cover up the pain that they're feeling. And that is through drinking, through drugs, through whatever it is that makes them feel better where they don't have to feel that pain anymore to smoking smoking weed, whatever, dope, whatever, uh, so that they don't feel the pain of the stress of thinking about the other person or what's going on in their lives. So, yeah, it is definitely sometimes, uh, even though the energy pulls itself, Taurus, but it may be for them to feel what they feel. It may not necessarily be for you to to feel uh, or for you to know. It's just, it could be for you to know that this is happening, but this could be for them to know that it's happening to them because of the decisions, because of the decisions that he or she made in their life that's causing them to want to come into this reading and want to come back for a second chance. OK, uh, because they can't they don't know how to fix it. They don't know how to heal the proper way. And that is to get help. And that is to learn how to love themselves, because it still clearly states, excuse me, that they're very unhealthy. OK, it still clearly states that this was a Capricorn or a Gemini you were dealing with. OK, uh, Taurus, and, and it shows in the reading that they're still doing unhealthy things at drinking, smoking, overindulging. When I say that, they're really like hanging off the side of the couch with the arm hanging off. Um, and they're really uh, he or she is really just overwhelmed and and depressed and uh, 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 stressed and. Um, and they want, they're going to send you a message for a second chance. But like I say, for some of you, for a lot of you, I really feel the energy that you're like, no, I don't want to have anything to do with this person. This person was very egotistic. Okay. They were very, very egotistic. And, um, I don't, I don't want to go. I'm not going back to that marriage, to that connection with that person. A lot of you have gained a lot of control in your life. You're in a different state of mind now. You're in a whole total different state of mind in your life. That was an old journey. You have moved forward. You are not interested whatsoever in this person at all. No way, no way, Tara says. Okay, so let's see. Spirit, Holy Spirit, 
What other message for Taurus? What's going on with, with Taurus X person? What's going on with Taurus X person? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I feel as though that you had to stand alone when you were dealing with this person. Okay. I feel like you, you stood alone. You know, it's like you had a hard time trying to figure out how to get out of this relationship. Okay. Yeah, this person is definitely stuck on you, Taurus. That's this is their energy. <clears throat> Taurus, you could have been dealing with the Aries. They're losing control. Why do I feel like this person um wants to commit suicide that just came in my spirit that this person is really uh they're losing control. Um why do I feel like they Thinking about committing suicide. Mm -hmm. You could have been dealing with the Aries. Uh, they're definitely not taking this good at all. They're really thinking about maybe hurting themselves. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. The energy is not good here. The energy is not good at all. Yeah, your person is stuck on you. This could have been someone you was dealing with. Recent past, oh, oh my goodness. Recent past, yeah. Um, you were married to this person, okay? You were married, you know, no longer married. You see your future somewhere else, yeah. Spirit, tell me more, okay? Look at this, yeah. Here it is. They, this person um, said a lot of hurtful words did a lot of hurtful things to you. You have moved forward in your life. You can't trust this person anymore. You have moved forward. You can't trust this person anymore. And um but they're they're at they're at a point in their life that they're ready. Um this person that you were dealing with is ready to give up. Okay. That's the energy that I'm getting. And Taurus said, I, I really feel like Taurus like, well you know, you should have thought about that when I was there and I tried to be good to you and I tried to do what I was required to do in a relationship and you took it for granted. And I don't know if, you know, they're coming, th they, their energy is coming through and they want you to know that they're, they're really feeling like, um, you know, that's the energy I get. They're feeling like, you know, they don't want to go on without you, um, that they're stressed out and they're they're about to want to end it. Um, that's the energy that I'm that I'm pulling here. Um, so they may reach out to you, Taurus, um, and um, I don't know. They're definitely um, doing a lot of unhealthy things, um, and um, that's not a way. That's not the way to get someone back. Uh, if you want someone back, you have to, you have to, you know, get yourself together, prove to that person that you have changed. And uh, that's how you do things to start to love yourself. But it's clearly to me in this reading, very clear, um, like binoculars, uh, that this person is still doing unhealthy things, a lot of drinking. Uh, they're, they're still stressed out. I don't know when you were dealing with this person, they had um, depression problems, but they're definitely overwhelmed. They're overwhelmed. They're, they're over obsessively stressed out. Do you hear me? Um, and yeah, they want to, he or she wants to return back into your life for a second chance, Taurus. This has been your reading. I am Positive Thoughts of Energy. Until next time.